What's up, YouTube? And welcome to another music reaction with me, Dyke Martinell. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, today's recommendation um, comes from... No idea. I am again going into my um, reaction ideas folder on YouTube. And now I'm choosing song 95 out of 201. Um, and this is for the band Mary's Blood and the song Marionette. Okay, so... Um, this is the band that I've heard of. I'm not sure if I've actually listened to them before. I do have a, um, I do have a pretty extensive Japanese playlist that once upon a time I created. I put some bands in there uh, on Spotify and then I use the enhancing and it, it like automatically puts bands that are, um, that it thinks I would like in there. Now get the feeling that Mary's Blood might have went in there once upon a time, but I can't recall. Um, so yeah, no, I, I, but I've definitely heard of this band for a long time, and I know, um, you know, there, there's a there's a bunch of bands that people consider to be like, you know, pretty classic um, Japanese female metal bands, and I'm pretty sure Mary's Blood's in there as well. Now, I done a tiny bit of research on Mary's Blood because I was wondering, I'm like, who's the person in this band that I know from other bands? And I'm pretty sure it's Saki, um, who is also the guitarist, I believe, from uh, Nemophila. Um, just to make sure I wasn't wrong, I, I did go onto Wikipedia and it tells me that. So if it's wrong, blame Wikipedia. But I'm pretty sure it's Saki that I, I know. There might be other members in this band as well that I might have seen in other bands. Um, but the, the, by um, my own thought in Wikipedia and looking at the members now, I think it might just be Saki. Um, anyway. Um, I'm keen to check this out, but before we check this out though, if you feel like you want to subscribe, that's great, thanks for that. If you do feel like you want to hit the bell, that's also great, thanks for that. And if you do want to put a like on my face, um, yeah. I've had terrible, um, usually I try and say stupid jokes during that, but my brain is too foggy this week. Still getting over the, uh, what you'd call the Rona. Wait, wait, should I do my reaction like this? I won't do that. Um, so yeah, no. Screw jokes. Let's listen to some uh, Mary's Blood. I'm a marionette, just a marionette. Wrong band. There's something familiar about this song. I wonder if I have heard it once upon a time. I don't know. Um, but yeah, it, there that, that chorus, I'm like, oh, I think I might have heard that chorus before. I'm not too sure. But no, this is cool. This is, um, this made me think of a few bands at the same time. I'm like, uh, um, it, it made me think of um, that dun, 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 kind of made me think of maybe a riff that Bright Ear or Brit Ear or however you want to say it um, would write. Um, oh, I definitely got kind of some Mardellas kind of vibes, uh, especially um, a little bit with the vocals, um, kind of that twangy, um, the vocal style. Um, I even got a tiny bit of like a Love Bites kind of vibe. Um, I don't know. This is, this is really, really cool. I'm enjoying it.
stop it um but i was just thinking oh, okay what about if copyright and blah 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 um so awesome guitar solo <laughs> um that was really really cool um i said this in um uh, a previous reaction today but i'll say it in this one as well um i like when guitar solos can have some complexity but then also bring in um, a melody um uh in this case again they've, they've brought in the vocal melody that -na 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 -na. like some people will say um you know, if you it, like, I know people have made fun of like um, guitar solos that all they do is use the vocal melody, like maybe um, "Smells Like Teen Spirit" or something. Um, but I, I love when the vocal melody is um, incorporated into the guitar solo. I think it brings a familiar, uh, you know, a familiarity to the solo, um, especially when the vocal melody is really, really catchy as well. So I thought that was awesome. The rest was awesome. Um, song's great let's we'll, we'll chat about it after the um after the song finishes Yeah, that was cool. Now there's been a slight gap in between the actual um, reaction and this part here because I was just doing a little bit of research because the vocalists sounded really familiar, but I wasn't sure whether or not they were just reminding me of other vocalists that um, I've heard in other bands. Um, so I believe that was the vocalist uh, um, I, or E, or it's spelled E-Y-E. -E. Um, 
who was the previous vocalist for Destros, but I don't believe that's the vocalist of Destros that I've seen before, because the um, vocalist of Destros that I know is Marina, who I believe is also now the Mardellis. <laughs> so, so many uh, musicians. So no, I, I, I think here, um, let me know if I'm wrong. Let me know if, um, if you guys have seen me do a reaction where I've seen this vocalist before. Um, but yeah, no, I, I get the feeling they were just um, reminding me of other vocalists that I've seen before. Anyway, that was a really long-winded point, but no, the song was great. Um, I thought it, it, you know, it had a lot of like, you know, heaviness, which is cool. Parts um, with those sort of metalcore riffs, like the da da type of riff, was reminding me a bit of like um, Bright Ear or again Bright Air or however you want to say it. Um, but then. Um, yeah, like the chorus, um, uh, the, the chorus probably was reminding me, and the vocals were probably reminding me a bit more of like Mardellus. Um, and I shouldn't be just comparing bands here. Um, I'm just saying, like, I got kind of those vibes. But no, the, the chorus was really, really catchy. I thought the vocals were great. Um, I, I thought, um, you know, she, she definitely has a really good singing voice. Um, and I do like how it went from like the metal core um, kind of heavy like verses and, the, and then the chorus sounded really really kind of um, uplifting um, and then I'm assuming that was Saki playing the guitar solos here I thought the guitar solos were great and again mentioning um, as I mentioned before I, I thought the bringing the, um, the vocal line or vocal melody into the guitar solo really suited it um, yeah I thought the drums were cool as well there were some brutal parts on the drums uh, which I thought was really, really, um, yeah, cool. It added some intensity. And yeah, that's about it for this one. Um, it was just, like, really cool to, um, finally check out some Mary's Blood. Again, I, get, I got the sneaking suspicion that I may have heard this song once upon a time, and I do think maybe Spotify did add it into that Japan Spotify, um, playlist I made, you know, two years ago, or a year and a half ago. Um, as it did sound vaguely familiar, but I definitely wasn't, like, ultra familiar if that is the case i wasn't ultra familiar with it i just think the chorus was like yeah i probably heard that before um but no that was awesome whoever made that recommendation thanks for that i appreciate that one um if anybody else has a recommendation hit me up in the comments below if it's something i've seen i shall let you know if it's something i haven't seen i'll try and get to it soon and that link there that link will take you to all my social media but the main thing there would be my discord where you can make recommendations uh that i see a little bit easier than the youtube ones uh where you can go there you can be pretty much almost i wouldn't say front of queue but almost front of the queue at the moment um whereas youtube you sit as, as position one of 100 no one of 201 at the moment <laughs> so um hint hint <laughs> anyway thanks for watching the video i shall catch you next time bye